YouTube. I'm walking through the underground from the hospital, trying to find my way to the Bank of China. Because um, when they registered my name, they registered a um, with my country as my first name, surname as my middle name, and first name as my last name. Can you believe it? So I'm heading to the bank in order to change it. And it's across the, the street. So crossing the street is always tricky here as you have to look in all directions so that nothing hits you. Well in fact they they won't actually hit you because uh, see I'm gonna just walk walk at the center of the road and the bikes are coming but they will all avoid me. They're all gonna avoid me. See that? I'm not taking my chances. So I have to use the zebra crossing over to the Bank of China. Crossing the road. Opportunity. Come on. I'm changing my details and these are the service staff. They're very helpful and warm and friendly. Um, so it's going to be done and then everything will be in order. Pools have a very distinct dialect. Um, and it, well, this is the southern Chinese dialect, uh, which is Ningbo Hua. So you can listen to it. Yeah? You, do you understand even a little bit of it? I think I'm beginning to be able to catch what he's saying. Having lived here for just over a month, I can catch a little bit of what he's saying. The taxi driver has been stopping, stopping, stopping on the, on the road um, because carpooling is a common practice here. So if I'm in the taxi and someone pulls down the taxi and is going in the same direction, they will pick him or her up. That means that the taxi driver will earn double by taking one trip. 
so you shall see.